So we have the 56th MMA history video, and it was Uf this is UFC 56, but it's called Full Force, and it was on Saturday as, all, as they all were um, until UFC 41, uh, but last that's the next one on the Friday night. Um, but again, this is Saturday, November 19th, 2005. Uh, UFC 56, Full Force, it was called. It was held at the MGM Grand Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. And the attendance was 12,000. Uh, 9,995 paid. Total gate was 1,986,000. The buy rate was 200,000. So. Yeah, so we had headlining the coaches from, uh, we brought in from the Ultimate Fighter Season 2, Rich Franken and Matt Hughes, um, scheduled to defend their middleweight and weight titles on here um, from Ultimate Fighter Season 2. Respectively, this event marked the first time that an Ultimate Fighter contestant <coughs> Season 1's Nate Curry with Quarry from Team Quest would compete for a... UFC Championship uh, to to highlight real knockouts, including a devastating knockout of Quarry were performed during UFC 56, which we go into in a minute. So, yeah, the total final payroll for the event was uh, 294,000. So. We're going to go straight to the preliminaries. Yes, so we got welterweight division preliminary cards, three of them. Um, first one, Nick Thompson, welterweight, defeats Keith Wisniewski. Never going to say his name. Keith Wisniewski. Uh, on a unanimous decision, three lots of five minute rounds. Nick Thompson beats him at welterweight. Another welterweight preliminary, preliminary. Uh, Thiago Alvarez, Alves, defeats. Thiago Alves defeats. Ansa Shalangov. Uh, TKO punches for two minutes and 25 of the first round. And you've got the light heavyweight, uh, Sam Hoga. Uh, from the Ultimate Fighter season one, he was in uh, defeats Jeff Newton uh, submission rear naked choke. Uh, two minutes and five seconds of the second round. Then you've got the main card starting with middleweight Jeremy Hall defeating Trevor Prangley. Uh, unanimous decision, three five minute rounds. The well, another uh, welterweight George St. Perrier GSP defeats Sean the Shark Shirk. TKO punches, elbows, 2 minutes and 53 of the second round. Then you've got the welterweight division again. Matt Hughes defeats Joe Riggs. Submission Kamira, 3 minutes and 28 seconds of the first round. Riggs was brought in as a replacement for Caro Parisian, the great judo exponent in the MMA arena, um, who suffered an injury in his training leading up to the belt. Although originally scheduled as a championship match, Briggs could not make the required weight for the championship at 170, and the belt was changed to a non-title welterweight match. So we got the last, oh yes, yeah, so the last two, heavyweight division, Gabriel Gonzaga defeats Keith Jordan, KO Superman Punch, uh, four minutes and 39 seconds of the third round, the middleweight division, Rich Franklin, or Franklin even, the teacher, defeats Nate Quarry from Team Quest. KO punch, highlight reel, knockout, 2 minutes and 34 of the first round. Lots, yeah, and he was from season one. Um, the ultimate fighter, he got injured in it, he was on crutches early. Um, yeah. I mean, the fight apart, yeah, I won't go for the fight. Yeah, and that's the 55th MMA video. Um, and 
This was on Saturday, November the 5th, at the MGM Grand Arena. UFC 56 called Full Force. Bang. 